Now in their third year in office, the Liberals have finally given notice they'll bring forward legislation for the assessment and approval of major energy projects. They promised to immediately review Canada's environmental assessment processes and introduce new, fair processes, ensure decisions are based on science, facts, evidence, and serve the public's interest. After approving major energy projects using Harper's gutted assessment process, will these laws actually strengthen the rights of communities and Indigenous peoples to have a voice in decision making? The Minister of Environment. Thank you, Mr. Speaker, and I'd like to thank the member opposite for the question. We are absolutely committed to rebuilding trust in our environmental assessment processes. We understand that the environment and the economy go together. The previous government gutted the uh, environmental assessment process, gutted, gutted the Navigable Waters Act, gutted the Fisheries Act, and as a result, they lost the trust in the public and couldn't get projects through. Projects stalled and there was polarization. We understand that we have an opportunity to bring people together, and in the 21st century, that the environment and the economy go together. That is the only way that we will move forward and get major projects going ahead.